Have you ever gazed up at the moon and wondered why it's slowly moving away from us? It's an intriguing question, isn't it? The moon, our celestial companion, is gradually drifting away, inching further from the Earth at a rate of about one and a half inches per year. This isn't some random event or a cosmic game of hide and seek. It's a result of specific scientific phenomena, a dance of cosmic forces that have been at play since the birth of our moon. Now imagine a cosmic tug of war, with the Earth and Moon pulling on each other. This dynamic interplay, coupled with the Earth's rotation, causes an interesting effect, leading to the Moon's slow but steady retreat. But don't worry, it's not packing its bags and leaving us forever. It's just a part of a grander cosmic ballet, a testament to the ever-changing nature of our universe. So, what are these forces at play that are causing our Moon to slip away? From our vantage point here on Earth, it's all about tides and friction. Now, you might be wondering, what does this have to do with the moon moving away? Well, it all boils down to a fascinating dance between the Earth and its lunar partner. This dance is directed by the invisible strings of gravitational interaction. Our Earth, being the larger partner, exerts a strong gravitational pull on the moon and vice versa. This mutual tug of war results in tides. Picture this, as the moon orbits Earth, its gravity pulls on our planet's water, causing a bulge or high tide on the side facing the moon. There's also a corresponding bulge on the opposite side due to the inertia of water. As Earth rotates, different areas pass through these bulges, creating the high and low tides we experience. But here's where things get interesting. These tides aren't perfectly aligned with the moon. Earth's rotation causes the tidal bulges to be slightly ahead. This results in a bit of a gravitational tug on the moon from the bulge, which gives the moon a slight push, causing it to speed up and move into a higher orbit. At the same time, this process acts like a break on Earth's rotation. It's a bit like a spinning dancer extending her arms. As she does so, she slows down her spin. Similarly, as Earth transfers energy to the Moon through tides, our planet's rotation slows down ever so slightly. This transfer of energy is not without consequence. As the Earth's rotation slows, days become a smidge longer. And as the Moon speeds up, it moves a tiny bit further away from us. It's a subtle but continuous process happening at a pace of about an inch and a half per year. So, in essence, the Moon's retreat from Earth is a slow, graceful dance. A dance that has been going on for billions of years and will continue for billions more. The Moon's retreat is a slow dance, choreographed by gravity and time. You might be asking, what does this mean for the future of our Earth and Moon? Well, as the Moon continues to gently drift away, it's going to have some interesting implications for our home planet. One of the most significant effects is that our day will gradually get longer. But don't worry, you won't need to adjust your alarm clocks just yet. This is happening incredibly slowly. In fact, the moon is inching away at a pace of about one and a half inches per year. That's slower than the rate your hair grows. Over billions of years, this slow drift could add up to a noticeable difference in the length of our day. But that's a story for the far, far future. So. While it's fascinating to think about the dance of celestial bodies and the tug of war of gravitational forces, there's no immediate cause for concern. In other words, there's no need to lose sleep over it. The moon isn't going anywhere fast. So to put it all in perspective, our moon, that familiar face in the night sky, is not as stationary as it appears. In fact, it's gradually drifting away, caused by the interplay of gravitational interactions and tidal friction between Earth and the moon. This gravitational dance is not without consequences though. As the moon recedes, it causes a subtle slowing of Earth's rotation speed, extending the length of our day. However, don't set your clocks just yet. These changes are occurring at an incredibly slow pace, almost imperceptible within a human lifetime. While the idea of the moon moving away may sound alarming, it's simply a part of the natural cosmic order. It's a reminder that our universe is in constant motion, always changing, always evolving. The next time you look up at the moon, remember it's not just a rock in the sky. It's a dynamic part of our ever-evolving cosmic